Hey guys, welcome to the first uh, trainer review on my YouTube channel. I haven't seen anyone post a uh, review of this shoe on YouTube yet, so I thought I'll record it, throw it up there, let people see the quality on the shoe and what it looks like overall. So if we get into the box first of all, it's actually just like the normal Nike Sportswear box, apart from the lid, which has is covered in um, the pattern on the district line seats from the London Tube. You can see the Nike logo there. If you're catching the right light, it's reflect, it reflects there. It's like the normal um, white sportswear box they throw on some releases, but just with that pattern on the top. If I show you the label with the retail next to it, I actually picked them up from Dover Street Market because even though I got the first train up to London, I um, still couldn't pick a pair up from the pop-up shop at Piccadilly Station. Uh, one more thing before we get into the shoe. Before we get into the actual shoe, I just wanted to show you a nice detail that Nike threw on this release. Yeah, the paper on the inside of the box is the London tube map. It's the whole tube map on there. It's completely white, but it's hard for you to see the details, but I just thought I'd give you a shot to see the overall sort of effect. The retail was 100 as I said earlier, which is quite surprising considering it's a special release and Nike will normally throw up the... Um, price on those but yeah it kept it at 100 for this and I think it was 95 for the um, Air Max one which I didn't pick up but you know let's get into the shoe it's a white midsole all the way around and a gum outsole the upper of the shoe is um, a full jacquard pattern with the panels being um, distinguished by changing colours on the pattern the hits on the eyelets and the Air Max logo there are sort of a dull gold, a bit more, a bit darker gold for the laces, and it's the same on the inside of the shoe. Can't really see it there. Sorry about that, but there is a white um, Nike Air logo in there as well. Another nice hit on the, sh uh, another nice detail on the shoe is the Air London Underground logo on the tongue there in black. Overall, nice quality. It's because it's woven, it's all one piece. It's a bit out of shape, it hasn't been worn yet. The tab on the back is all white. I saw someone on Instagram throw white laces in them, which look maybe 10 times better and a lot more wearable as well. And that's the shoe really guys. If you have any tips on how to make my future reviews better, then just leave a comment down below. If you like the video, like it. If you want to see some, a few more sneaker videos like this one, then subscribe to the channel.